I told you, I told you, I told you. You guys see this thumbnail right here? This is from almost exactly two months ago. I was saying, do not buy these 151 boxes. I think they can hit below 40. And look at where we are at today. We are at $42 on Sneaker Dunk. If you guys aren't familiar, I'm going to explain if Sneaker Dunk's legit and everything about it, okay? And other places and all the current uh, prices of Japanese booster boxes, including 151. So currently, $42 is what you can get them for. Yes, there are fees. The yes, there is shipping. But that is what you are paying for the box. So how Sneaker Dunk works. And I'm going to give you guys the final cost, right? We're, we're coming up on that. So don't worry. Stay tuned. And also, if you guys want to not miss deals like this, make sure you subscribe, okay? Because I, I, I called this a long time ago. And I do think that uh, this has potential to drop to 40 and below. There's still... Anyways. So, Sneaker Dunk is a third-party authenticator. So, a seller wants to sell something, then they ship it to Sneaker Dunk. Sneaker Dunk authenticates it and then ships it out. So, that's why there's a shipping fee and then there's a processing fee because Sneaker Dunk has to authenticate it. So, you're making sure you're getting legit boxes. Now, if you guys look right here, uh, I have it scrolled down because I just didn't want to show my address, but this is for me. I'm in California, so uh, your shipping may vary depending on where you are. This is for 10 boxes, 10 boxes of 151, 482, which comes out to $48.20 per box, okay? That's the cheapest you can get it anywhere right? You might find some TikTok deals here and there, but I just went on TikTok and the cur the cheapest currently was around like 50 something and it had shipping. So it ended up being around 60 a box. So 48 a box. This is to the point where, and we're going to talk about single prices as well. This can be profitable to rip possibly. Well, we're going to talk about it, right? And let's talk about eBay, right? <clears throat> currently, if you want with shrink, this is the cheapest that you can get on eBay, $64.90, okay? So this that's what you're looking at on eBay. Now, what's crazy is Sneaker Dunk announced that they had a big stock of everything, right? And take, take this for example, this is just another, I'm just throwing this out there. Also, I do wanna preface that Sneaker Dunk is legit. You do have buyer protection. I have purchased from them before uh, multiple times and I will purchase from them again. So um, I, I have no worries. I have no problem uh, recommending them, okay? So just keep that in mind. Look at the price for this boost. So this is like Future Flash, which I believe is what? Um, temp is this Temporal? Anyways, uh, sorry, I don't know if, I, if I'm getting the English name wrong. Uh, anyways, but you can see right here, $18 per box, right? So... If you guys want to rip some Japanese boxes, if you want to just keep them and invest in maybe long term, obviously the prices are down on them right now, but you guys have to remember, this is something I talked about before, the Japanese yen is really down. Japan is in a recession, okay? So the US dollar goes a long way when, when purchasing uh, some of these boxes. So, and Pokemon Company is going to want, they're going to be reprinting for a while, it seems like, that's kind of their motive because they need money. It, it, times are not good over there. So this is a good time to buy, whether you want to rip or, or keep sealed for the future, up to you. I'm just telling you guys what is available out there. Now for this one, this is 10 boxes again, 235 for 10 boxes, $23 and 50 cents per box. You got to remember MSRP on these is like 38, 40, I think, uh, USD. So you're well under USD for these boxes. So if you want to rip some cheap product, uh, English booster boxes are expensive. If you want to just get some to rip, get some to sit on sealed, maybe pick some of these up. Okay. Next up, uh, this is the Ancient Roar, which is like, uh, this is Paradox Rift or, uh, yeah, right? It's Paradox. Um, yeah, I believe so because of the Roaring Moon. Same thing, 18 a box. Okay. Now, also, when you select your quantities, they can differ on the prices depending on what sellers have what quantities available. So depending on your time of day or whatever, that may vary a little. So just keep that in mind. Now, for 10 boxes, this is 10 boxes again right here, uh, 249 So you're looking at, just call it 25 per box. MSRP is like 38 
you're already you can resell these immediately if you wanted to and you can make money you can hold and like i i'm sorry to also make another video about japanese boxes again but like guys i i, I told you and i'm telling you now okay i'm telling you guys now don't miss out on this let's just take a look at some of the singles so this is where i was talking about with the 151 it these singles while they have gone down from you know over time this charizard is still at around 80 and you can see some of the sales here 80 to 90 even some in 100 we'll just call it we'll call it 90 right 85 90 this you can probably like the singles are holding strong so if the singles are holding strong and the box prices are dipping, you can almost rip these for profit and sell the cards. Potentially, potentially. I'm not advising anybody to do that. Pull rates are a little different with the Japanese, but they also have master balls, which can go for a lot. So, I mean, we'll, we'll just take a look at another card here. All right. So we got the this card, the Zapdos actually went up from last month, according to this right here. But, you know, you see the sales down here. 36 50 38 so i mean i guess that's fairly accurate you call it 38 39 dollars once again that you might be able to make money ripping these boxes I, I, let's take a look at the venusaur it went up a little bit same thing over may and we're around 35 36 dollars right here are some of the last sales which is actually higher than what this is saying at 32 okay this this is this might be the time to, to strike while the iron is hot now you may want to wait uh like i said i if they keep if they do another reprint like they've talked about like a july and this this keeps going you, you can get it for cheaper but what's the difference between say it goes to 38 right which i feel like might be the actual bottom for this box like just below 40. Uh, it could go lower like some of the other ones but i doubt it. i think the demand is way too high but if it does dip below 40 like what's the difference like are you guys going to be kicking yourself over 42 to 38 four dollars a box come on <laughs> i mean all right blastoise you know what do i got to say it went up same thing you know 35 40 bucks a card right depending and yeah you guys can you guys can rip this product um that's that's i i i'm just i'm so happy one that I kind of ended up being right, and I did end up being right. I'm gonna just say it, say I was super excited for that. Um, and like I said, if you guys, this is just my thoughts. Like, um, so for me personally, I'm not really probably wanting to pick up some of the other boxes that I was talking about. I probably would mainly want to focus on 151. But if you want to pick up, pick them all up while they're super cheap. I mean, you can't go wrong. If you want to rip them, rip them. If you want to keep them sealed, keep them sealed. If you want to do both, do both. I'd probably do both, right? And if you guys have been dollar cost averaging this whole time, like I had said in some of my previous videos, you'd be sitting really well right now. Because if you, if when the price finally got down to like 70 and 60 and you guys were like, oh yeah, yeah. And I was saying, wait, you know, and you spent all your money that you had, you know, set aside for boxes or whatever. And maybe you have more now, but you know, you could have, if you lease a dollar cost average, you would have had still some available now and your average would be really good. So, um, just keep that in mind guys. Just keep that in mind. If you made it this far in the video and you're not already subscribed, obviously you enjoyed the content. Obviously you want to get better deals. So, um, make sure you subscribe. I would really appreciate it. Drop me a comment. If you're picking up any of these boxes, these prices are crazy right now. This is a great time to be collecting Japanese, um, 151 or Japanese of any booster boxes. It's these prices are too good. I can't wait uh, to just keep scooping up more. Can't wait to see if the price falls. Really excited about it. Um, yeah, but that's gonna do it for this one, guys. I'll catch you guys in the next one. And remember, it was never a phase.